What's going on guys? Big Shan here. It's the big man. What's going on? We got game three of AMAC Rilo here. AMAC showing uh, a lot of uh, comfort uh, in the snake matchup here. Not really scared of what Rilo's putting out when Rilo's taking his time. Uh, it'll be interesting to see if there is tricks left in the back. 
from Rylo. Uh, because right now we've just kind of seen him playing the Snake game and not really playing the Diddy Kong game. Ryler taking his space a little bit more, standing still and throwing out tilts, letting AMAC challenge, acknowledging that the Diddy Kong is the one approaching, uh, which is working out okay, but uh, AMAC going to uh, SD there for his first stock. Nice little down air, misses the second one, and now we've got a bit of a scramble going on. <laughs> oh. Misses the punish there, and now it's going to be a reversal from AMAC. That grenade's going to get in the way, and uh, dash attack on the ledge. So good for Snake. But Rylo, a lot of times, is letting Diddy Kong reset, letting him get the banana up, but it doesn't matter. Up almost a whole stock now. Uh, trade's already very beneficial for Snake, but being up a whole stock, uh, it's going to make it very, very hard for AMAC to make a comeback without... Um, a miraculous combo or, or string uh, to kind of even things out. Because if things continue to go the way they go, uh, Amax just going to accrue a lot of percent. And by the time he does get Rylo's next stock off, uh, it'll be too little too late. Gets grabbed there. That was some insane grab range. Must have been some hurt box extension. Uh, Amax slowing it down a little bit. And does not check the C4 there. Rylo sneaks out of game three here. Uh, really short up, especially after the SD from AMAC. He said, this is my chance, I'm not going to squander it. Nice stuff from Rattle. Same characters going into game four here. Uh, and we'll see if Amac, this is his first counter pick of the set, um, uh, where he opts to go. I know he loves Stadium. He won on Stadium. He goes to town. I think these platforms allow Diddy Kong a lot of freedom of movement, especially in this kind of V formation, the inverse of the classic triplat. Uh, monkey flip becomes such a strong and threatening option because you can uh, monkey flip all over the stage without really ever touching the stage itself, just staying on those platforms. Um, not that AMAC is necessarily going to do that, but the threat of it um, pays in dividends, usually. Oh, nice little catch there from AMAC. Gonna get the first stock. Really, really smart uh, from that first fair to uh, tech chasing on the moving platform. Uh, a Smash 4 veteran, no doubt. Probably the, the veteran of all Smash 4 veterans. Back throw from Rilo here into Nikita is going to force Amac uh, onto his second stock. Now Rilo's interested in disengaging and playing the lead. Uh, he has not use the x-axis uh, to move forward or backwards. He's mostly just pulling projectiles, throwing projectiles, and uh, seeing how far that gets him. And so far, it's doing pretty good. 11% uh, on uh, AMAC's second stock, but now AMAC is uh, on the on the offensive here, has a banana in hand, has Rylo on ledge, sees a fair, gonna dr Z drop banana, but the Cypher is going to kind of cancel it out. That's one of those things about Snake. Uh, a lot of times Cypher kind of wins the game for you in, in edge guarding or trapping situations, uh, but does clean up the stock. Uh, Amac, no interest in this corner here, uh, up a whole stock, doesn't want to lose it for nothing and wants to push his lead as hard as he can. Gets a down air from Snake here, and now it is. Wow. Scary little interaction there on the little lip of town. Known to be a little janky, uh, but maybe that's just me. Z catches the banana. Down it. <laughs> Goes for barrels. I love the thought. Amac kind of playing with his food a little bit here, and uh, it seems to be working just fine for him. Down tilt. Trips on his own banana. <laughs> We're in kind of the FD formation here. 
Uh, and I actually think this benefits um, Diddy Kong a little bit more in this situation here because you're asking Snake to approach uh, on a flat surface, which is kind of uh, tricky. Does air dodge through that and really, really classic smart stuff from AMAC going to uh, position himself uh, in the top six. AMAC takes it over Rilo, 3-1. I've been Big Sham. <laughs>